Tonight at 11, we're hearing from the president and CEO of the Eugene Area Com Chamber of Commerce about a lawsuit dismissed by a judge today that could have opened restaurants back open for dine-in. Thank you for joining us, Some China Grain. KEZI 9 News reporter Connie McCarthy spoke with her early this evening and joins us live from Eugene to share her reaction. Connor. China, Brittany Quick Warner says that she is disappointed the federal judge's decision to toss out that lawsuit. Now, she says that she wants people to be safe and protected from the coronavirus, but she says there are other ways to achieve that. That does not include shutting down local restaurants. The lawsuit was filed by the Oregon Restaurant and Lodging Association in federal court claiming the industry was being treated unfairly compared to others. They argued other industries like personal services, schools and outdoor sports didn't have to shut down. Quick Warner says what makes the shutdown for restaurants different than the last is that there's little to no support from the federal or state government to provide relief. Uh, this time around, the, the money that the state has been allocating has gone so quickly. There was a grant that opened last Thursday afternoon that was closed within 20 minutes. Um, it had such high demand. Quick Warner says hopefully during the proposed special session by House Speaker Tina Kotick, lawmakers will be able to pass bills that will send relief to small businesses. Now, China Quick Warner says what you can do to help small businesses is shop local, especially during this holiday season, and also to follow all CDC and OHA guidelines because she says if there's compliance there, businesses will stay open. Reporting live in Eugene, Connor McCarthy, KZI 9 News.